All right, hello? Hello, hello. You hear me? Yeah. All right, what's going on, my man? How you doing? Good, how you doing? Make it happen, you know. Boring stuff. It's pretty boring, but it's all good. Hmm. Um, so, uh, before we get started, I guess we'll just talk about a few things. Um, so do you have any FPS experience at all? Did you play Counter-Strike? Nope. Anything? Okay, so this is this your is first... I, I... I guess I played a little bit of Overwatch, but I only right. played Reinhardt, so... <laughs> Alright, yeah, yeah. It's, it's so basically nothing. Gotcha, gotcha. Yeah. Uh, okay, that's fine. Um, how long have you played Valorant? Just basically since it's been released? Yeah, since it's been released, yep. Alright, cool. Uh, what agents do you play? What are you, who are your favorites? Uh, my favorites are Sova and Cypher. I just unlocked right. Cypher, so... Okay, so gotcha, gotcha. His spot. That's good. I think Sova is one of the best... Him and Brimstone are the best champs to uh, learn with, so that's good. Good for playing him. I would suggest sticking with him. We'll get to that later if we need to. But uh, uh, do you have anything, any specific questions or any specific things you're looking for? If not, it's fine. But I just want to make sure if you do, if there's something you want me to be paying attention more for it. Um, yes. Uh, I would say just the basics. Like I feel like I've never played an FPS before. Okay, so like, kind of like basics. Gotcha. Uh, is that pretty much it? Yeah, and one, uh, I guess, more pinpointing stuff, for example, uh, you plant a bomb and, like, what spots to sit at or, like, okay. stuff like that. I I'll, I'll point it out once. Yeah, okay, sounds good, sounds good. All right, uh, can you see my... Wait, I need to stream, don't I? That would be... You need to see what's going on. Oops, that's not what it. Yep. Okay, can you see this? It's loading, but yeah. Uh, you can't see it now. Clear. I can see it. Ju I, I can see it. Just Discord takes time to load, so okay. I'll let you know once it's done loading. Gotcha. <laughs> oh wait, I hit video. That's the problem. Okay, now it might load quicker. Uh. No, it's loaded. Okay, yeah, that, nah, I'm an idiot, sorry. Uh, can you let does everything look clear? Revealing Say that again? Everything look clear? Like, everything looking okay? Uh, the quality is absolute trash, but yeah. Is it? Yeah. Okay, uh, hold on a sec. Yeah. Hitting the wrong button, I'm sorry. did this. Actually, this would be better. Okay. Better, better. Does it look better? Yeah. Okay. All right. Perfect. I was about to say I, this. You can see my mouse too, right? Correct. Okay. Perfect. That that's what I need. All right. So we'll just go round by round for the most part. Um, and then what we'll probably do is, since you want to look at fundamentals, there's really not anything specific I'll go into. Um, I'll just mainly kind of teach you, like we said, the basic things, and we'll just kind of go from there. So we'll probably jump around a lot, but uh, that's fine. And like I said, okay. if there's anything you want to point out that you have a specific question about, we'll just we'll get into it. So, all right, mm -hmm. well, let's just we'll start start it up. I'm assuming that's like a specific little. Yes. Okay. Uh, can you? The stream quality is still really bad. Is it? No, no, yeah, I don't know Shoot. why. Oh, uh, let me. Let me X out a few things in the background. Recording. Uh. There's a way to adjust something. that do anything? Hello? It, it it does, but when you start playing the video again, it goes to crap. Like, okay, okay. Let me uh, let me try calling you then and adding you to that. That might help. Okay. Hopefully it helps. Okay, hello? Yeah. Go ahead and share your screen. Okay, yeah, I can get more specific with this. You see the mouse? Yep. Yes, okay. I can. Is it any better? 
things went. Yep. This is a lot okay. better. Okay. Oh, good. All right. That's all I need to know. Perfect. Perfect. Okay. Um. Healing. We'll just play the round out, and I'll go back. Don't think I can hear the sounds, but that's fine, I guess. Okay. Uh, it should it shouldn't matter too much. Revealing area. Chuck target. So my thought process here is, okay, we have the bombs. I just planned. And yeah. Okay. So yeah, I guess we could just we could go here. So this you did this at the beginning of the round. You're also doing it here. So. This is one of the first key fundamentals of the game. So wait, what, uh, did you play any games before this? Like, what, do you have any, obviously I'm assuming you, you're a gamer, but like, what other games yeah. do you play? Anything else, really? Yeah, so, a lot of Overwatch, or Overwatch, okay. and then, uh, League of Legends. Okay, so you play League. Style. Okay, cool. Uh, so, in an FPS, um, the fundamentals are different from a game like League because the fundamentals of this game are, are, are really su uh, suggested around aiming, of course. Now, right. once you get to higher levels of play, that actually becomes less, in my opinion. Because once you get to higher levels of play, uh, positioning is huge. Uh, you know, all that stuff is, is really, really important. But at, at a low level and at a new level, um, aiming is really what we need to focus on right now. Because at the end of the day, it's like playing basketball. Like, you can know exactly what you need to do. You can know exactly how to... You can know exactly how to drive the lane or whatnot, but if you can't, if you can't get to hit the layup, it doesn't matter. So the first fundamental, um, with your aiming is crosser placement. And so you'll see a lot of uh, a lot of pro players do this. You need to always have your crosser at the head level. So I see you you're walking around corners. You just kind of have it. You know what I'm saying? Let's say somebody right. came through the smoke right here, right? Let's just just be hypothetical, mm -hmm. right? You're aiming where their chest would be. Uh, you know what I'm saying? Correct. Right. Yeah, and, you always and, wanted to be yeah, around their head. You always wanted to be around their head. And that, that becomes really, really important um, as, as time goes on. Because the thing is, if somebody came through the smoke and you're aiming at their chest, uh, you're going to be like, oh, shoot, you know, I got to be ready. Now, there's another thing here. You, you really, you're not really doing anything here. You're just kind of sitting. Like, your team has, your teammates pushed out. Uh, your Phoenix has uh, is holding the angle. Right. Um, you're sitting here isn't doing much. Now, if you're watching the smoke, that's good. But at the end of the day, um, you need to be in a better position to do that because you're kind of standing out in the middle. So uh, the first thing, like I said, first things first is cross replacement. That, that's that's a huge fundamental of, a, of an FPS game, any FPS game. Um, and so that that's that's like that's the one thing I've noticed already. So whatever, anytime you're holding angles, oopsies. Anytime you're holding angles, uh, make sure you always have your cross your head level. Um, so yeah, that, that's like the first thing. Now, I noticed it a little bit more. I hope this ends. Yeah, right here. Uh, see you just kind of aiming around like you're not really like it, if somebody flew around this corner like you're probably dead you know what i mean um or if right. somebody peeks any of these angles you're probably you just gonna probably lose the fight but if you had your crosshair at the right spot that would have helped you at least helped you um get to that fight better win that fight better so that's good now here um well i guess we can just let it play out a little more revealing area I don't want to get too into positioning stuff because I can see you're you're pretty new, so we really just need to focus on the more important stuff. I can I see. So. <laughs> Your competition's amazing, by the way. <laughs> yeah, just go back B. Just turn around, do a switch or back to B. I cannot hear it, but yeah. <laughs> yeah, you said turn around, do a switch or back to B. Um, so yeah, there's a lot. There's some more positioning stuff we could have talked about there. Um, you you, you really should have just entered the site because. This is this map sucks, by the way. Um, so at this point, uh, at this point, uh, you could probably assume that there's nobody in the backside, right? Like they right. would, they would have shot you by now. Like you know that. So or at least we checked it or checked our car. Right, right. That's, yeah, that's what I'm saying. So you could have, you could have assumed that if somebody played here, that you would have been dead by now, right? Or right. you would have at least seen known. So what is now the most important, the important thing to worry about? There's two. Uh... I like, I guess, what's when, the more, what what positions could the enemy be in that's like scary? If if that I guess helps. He heaven. Okay, heaven's one. And then C D because okay. yeah. Yeah, okay. So so what 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 is your sage doing right now? She's watching C T. Yes. Yeah, so it. you're just kinda you know what I'm saying? See you're kinda standing here. Now this peak effectively was bad because all you're doing is putting yourself in a situation to lose a fight when you don't have to. You don't have to take this fight. All you have to do is get the bomb and get outside and plant it. 
Um, because then that makes them come to you, and effectively you're you're going into them if you do this. Uh, does that make sense? Yeah. Yeah. So a, another, I guess, fun. This is kind of fundamental. It is, but it's it's a little more a little more different. Is uh is is dueling really? Like whenever you take fights with people, um, it has to be in the right scenario. So you peeking here and taking the fight is bad because even if you like you 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 do get the kill, right? Uh, right. This guy, you kill him. Uh, oh wait, did you? No, I kill him, but just in future. Oh. Or, yeah. Yeah, 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 I yeah. kill him. Like... I have this fight. Right. You win this fight. Now, I don't know what your sage is doing. She took the bomb, so it's whatever. But let's say, in theory, you lost it. That's very bad. You know what I'm saying? So even right. though you killed this player, that that's you don't want to do that. That's not what you want to be looking for. Because you want to be looking to, in order to win the, uh, you can break it down. Like, um, in order to win a round, you plant the bomb. That's what you do. Mm -hmm. So you, you, you're not planting the bomb as effectively throwing, really. Um, and I mean that in a nice way. You know, you know what I'm saying. No, no, no. But let's say in this situation, let's say Sage planted the bomb mm -hmm. and she was holding CD. Like she, she was, she was standing where she was and looking at CD. And yeah, I yeah. do this play where I peek. So is it still a bad play? Yes, because what sorta. Of. So the reason I say sorta of is you're still taking a fight for them. This guy is holding. I'm pointing at the screen like you can see my fingers. This is hilarious. <laughs> this guy <laughs> is. Let's. He's want. He wants you to uh, peek to him. He's gonna sit here, or if in theory, he's gonna sit here and wait. Now, if you hold uh, right here, like what this sage is doing, uh, play a little back. Don't play up against the wall. But you know, if you do what she's doing, now they have to come to you, and that's what you want. You effectively, not always, but most of the time, want to take fights that are favorable for you. And if you peek into them, that is not favorable uh, because he's watching this. You know what I'm saying? Like I said, you peek into this guy. Now, t this is actually like not the worst peek. Like I said, it was kind of bad because you guys should have just got bombed down. But you did make the right decision of peeking once she jumped across because now this player was focused on her and then you go for the kill. That part was good. I, I don't think I, <laughs> that wasn't right. Right. And I, that, I'm letting, I know you, don't, you probably didn't do that on purpose, but uh, you see what I'm saying though, right? All right. So yeah, th this is very very important. Um, putting yourself in positions to to succeed is is number one priority. And you, you not planning the bomb and you taking this fight is is just effectively not doing that. Um, so, so so I get that. Uh, right. I, like I analyze my play as well, and like okay. I I realize that I was not doing that. So now what I do is like I hold an angle, but like every time an enemy comes, like. Sometimes, like even if I'm holding an angle, they have like a faster reaction time, I guess, and they right. shoot me first. Like, so what? How to improve that? That is just you need to work on proper proper angle holding and uh, just just aim mechanics is all it is. We'll I'm whenever I see it, I'm sure this will happen. Uh, yeah. we'll, we'll point it out. Um, okay. I actually it was helping my friend out. I was just watching him play like 20 minutes ago, and he had the same issue. Where somebody flew around the corner and he just died and it was like all he had to do is just aim out differently uh and like i said i'll explain it when we get to it but yeah uh, okay. does that make sense so far everything everything kind of clear yeah. okay oh you guys do get bombed out okay let's see oh you're dead okay then whatever how'd you die though actually let me let me see One enemy <laughs> left I hate with that. I don't know why this is so slow. Oh no, she's having. Yeah, uh, and so th this is a, this is a similar scenario, uh, sort of. So you know, you guys are about to plant the bomb. Ray's has to come to the bomb site. Where could she come from? Uh, she can come from from CT. She can come from heaven, and she can come from mid. So you need to put yourself in a position to where you can watch one of those angles safely. And here, you just kind of ran past it. Um, yes. so so, so you, you should expect her there essentially. Um, yes, but the, I assume so. Like the stage was running in front of me, so I assume she checked all the corners. Right, and, right. Like, I did not. Check yeah, corners. and that's okay. That that's not bad to think. But at the end of the day, you you're never gonna be able to control what your teammates do. So even if she right. did check that, she might just get dropped. You know what I'm saying? So yeah. Um, okay. al always kind of always be second guessing what your what your teammates do, especially when you're new, because they're also new effectively. So it's like they're also making a lot of mistakes. Um, right. but does that make sense? Why I'm telling you, you should you should be wary of this angle um yes but like so what should have done differently when you should have from... uh right here like i said like okay so you're like i said your team's picking the bomb site w where can where can rays come from uh ct to heaven mid right so you right. know she can come from there right so you should mm -hmm. if you pick up this gun that's fine and you should hold this angle you should sit right here you should have gone back behind this little box i hate that i, could, I wish i can go back like three seconds but it's fine 
Uh, grab this gun, sit by that box, and just hold it and wait. Because she, like I said, she has to come to you, and that is a favorable fight for you. Um, does that make sense? Yeah. Okay. And now, I'll, 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 again, go. Go ahead. Go ahead. Oh, I was just gonna say you you do eventually also have to be wary of mid, um, but that's okay because you can kind of you can kind of jiggle between these two angles. Right. Um, you could just see that and see this. Um, now there's another thing you could have done here, but I don't really want to talk about that. It's a little more advanced. Um, but yeah, does that does this all does this all make sense so far though? Yeah. Okay. Uh, what were you saying though? Uh, I I forgot. I don't know. Okay. Okay. <laughs> it's fine. Uh, okay. Cool. And so yeah, th this uh, actually let's just wait. Uh, it'll happen again. Okay. That's fine. Nothing wrong with that. I'm just gonna let it play at this point. This is see this this kind of goes back to my uh, aiming headshot level. Because if he peeks this, you're aiming at his at his kneecaps. <laughs> so it's gonna be hard for you to kill him. But, but is it really? Because Oh wait, I see never mind, never mind, never mind. You're aiming for if I, I I'm thinking if he peeks that like because you know there's like a little there's like a, a ramp oh, part. Oh right you're saying okay. Yeah, yeah, he, okay, he okay, yeah. This is fine, this is fine. Sense. Uh but this this kinda this is another sort of a thing when it comes to holding an angle. If you're holding an angle where they can peek from two different for lack of a better term, okay. yeah, we'll say levels. Uh, this is bad, because if he peeks from lower level, you have it covered. But if he peeks upper, you're not ready. So okay. this is where you need to be careful. So instead, you could have... Now, you have a teammate here, so it's not as bad. But you're probably not thinking about that. Um, but um, but yeah, that, uh, you get the right idea. I don't know, okay, she walled that and... Okay, whatever. I don't know why she did that. Get out of the way. Yeah, this is good. You have the right idea of just waiting. I don't know why he threw that there, but it, it's okay. Um, good. This is fine. Are you wary? That, that's fine too. I'm trying not to talk too much about like positioning things because I just need to teach you how to how to fundamentally play the game. You know what I mean? Okay. This is all fine. I wish I could. I hate how this is laggy. It's so annoying. Oh, uh, you can turn down the, I guess, the quality. Is it like super? No, much? I don't think that's the issue. I mean, maybe. Let's let's see. I don't think that's gonna help much. If it does, then sick. I don't know what but this. I never have these issues, anyways. Like this, maybe because I'm recording. I don't know. Yeah, it doesn't really change much. It's okay. It's it's it's. We'll we'll deal with it. You die here. Do you remember? Oh, uh, I did not. Okay. Okay. So yeah. And I said this was played like two days ago, so I don't That's remember. true. You, you don't. Okay. So Yeah, I guess we could just talk about the post plant. Um a little bit. So you're holding this angle being wary of her, but what you're not thinking of is actually wait, your stage is here. Okay, forget I said that. Take that back. Okay, this is fine. This is good. Uh do you realize why this is this isn't bad though, right? Because right, because like heaven's covered by Cypher and then she got seen. Okay, yeah, time. perfect. That's okay, exactly. So this is fine. Uh, once again, though, work on your crosshair placement. Um, I mean, I'm telling you this now, not while you're so, playing so the game. So where should exactly be the crosshair? Be? Uh, where their head's going to be. So this is an interesting spot because it's hard to hold angles on ramps because you have to aim it differently, right? Um, so right. I would have put my cross... You see my mouse, right? Like here. Right. Or eh, a little higher, like right here. Because if she, if she, her head would be right here when she comes around the corner, but you're not going to react to that. You know what I'm saying? Like, nope, no human is reacting to that. You're so realistic... You never... Second, go. So you never want your crosshair like how I have it right now. You want it yeah. like further away. From yeah, the you wall. you want to hold it now. Now this act this this depends on you as a player and how fast your reactions are. If you think you can hit the shot, then go for it. But nine times out of ten, it's gonna be a lot harder. You know what I mean? Mm -hmm. So aim out a little bit. Uh, this is kind of going into your your question of whenever people peak angles, how do I uh, how do I um, you know, how do I how do I win the fight? Um, right. And, and I'm sure this will pop up here in just a bit again. But you, does that that kind of make sense though? Yes. Yeah. Okay. Cool. Well, so like I said, when we get to that spot, uh, you probably should have just done what your team did here and just don't peek into that. Just wait because you you know how it works, right? If the if the thing is yellow, it won't see you. Let me see. Oh, I didn't know that. Yeah. So this yellow, I see now it's red. If it's red, it can see you. If you can see this oh. bolt with your eyes, it sees you. But if it's yellow, it can't. So when he shoots it right here, 
And this is useful for you to know. Cause you, yeah, right there. Well, shoot. You, you know what I'm saying. Uh, whenever yeah, you weren't seeing it. it, it was yellow. And you could have just hid. And that's what your teammates did. And then you just beat it to it. But this is this is good for you to know, too, because you play Sova. So if people aren't on your thing, they could be right around the corner, for all you know. But they're just not actually in it. So keep that in mind. Interesting. Um, okay, that's fine. So here's the fight where I should not have taken this fight. Like, um, I'm, I'm holding the angle, right? Yeah, but see, this is the example of where you're, I, I, so you're holding the angle a little incorrectly. So you're not aiming head level. Head levels could be like at the, eh, actually, yeah, okay. Head level is like a, a barely up, a little bit higher. It's like the, it's like right where the point of my mouse is. Like go up to like halfway and aim out to here. Cause I guarantee if you aim out to where my mouse is now, you get the kill. Uh, okay. You swung a little bit, but that's okay. See, you moved out a little bit. So it's a little easier to hit, but if you were staying in that spot, does that make sense? You did, since you moved, it was just. Um, it was, you could just Wait. react quicker. So I should have stayed in that spot. If you stayed just... in this spot, it's not bad. Right here. But as long as you move your crosshair a little bit. Crosshair, okay. Right, right. Uh, and then once you move, you can react quicker. But see what I'm saying? Like, I guarantee, you're right by his head. You, your crosshair placement's not bad. Um, but if you wouldn't have moved it and you aimed it out to the left a little bit, it would have been better. Um. Also, the gun recoil, I guess. It's right, right. Yeah, and at the end of the day, you probably shouldn't really peek this because you have an SMG. But... For the, for the, you know, like I said, for the sake of the argument, uh, right, yeah. you see what I'm saying. Um, and then, yeah. Uh, okay. And then, so also, you have an SMG, so make sure you just spray with it. Uh, okay, uh, let's skip ahead. What's going on? Okay, now you have a rifle. This is, this is, this is the juicy part. God, we're already 20 minutes in. Okay, I mean, it's fine. It's just, jeez. We probably won't watch this. Do usually do the... It's like an hour. I mean, it's fine. Huh? About an hour long. Um... But, like I said, we'll just watch a good few sides, uh, rounds on this side and a good few rounds on CT side. Um, there they are. Right down here, you got spotted. But now you know how that works, so it's fine. Yeah. What is your, what's your, what's your plan for this round? What do, what do you want to do, by the way? I want to, I want to see if you're... <laughs> I want to do. Uh, yeah, well, I want to see if your your decision makes at least kind of right. Because, like I said, for what what I'll probably do is like like what we're doing. It's focused pretty much primarily on aim, and right. then once you practice your aim some, we can come back and work like in like a week or two. We you can come back and we'll work on more positioning and stuff like that. That's why I'm trying not to do too much of that because it's just overwhelming. Um, yeah. Because I got I've I played I play league too, and I've been coached in league. And if a coach just tells you all this stuff, it's just like you just don't you don't really know what happened after <laughs> effectively. Right. So I'm trying to try to keep that even, but I I guess the plan is to push with the bomb, but like okay, I mean that's that, that, yeah it, it, okay. I'm glad I'm glad you acknowledge that. It's so it's like solo queuing in league. Like you you really can't trust your teammates. You just <laughs> right. you kind of just <laughs> gotta carry. Like it is what you it don't is. Don't know where they're going. So yeah, I'm but uh, well, that's fine. Um, yeah, just make sure when you're playing, you're at least peeking together. So this is. Well, okay, I'll, I'll go. I'll talk about this. It might be a little, little like too much. Not, it's not too much, but like I don't want to. That's gonna sound offensive, but it's just not really. Like I said, I want to be focusing on just aim. But in FPSs, at least in Counter Strike and Valorant, the uh, trade frags are huge. So whenever you peak an angle, let's say your Sage peaks, she dies to this Phoenix, right? Uh, right. That it's now four v five, and she doesn't die. But if y'all peak together. Um, he more than likely would only kill her and then you kill him back or vice versa, whatever. Uh, and right. that's a trade and trades are good for T side because if it's, let's just, let's just say it's four good people, for uh, good for, I said T side, like, I'm sorry, I'm playing counter strike or good for attackers. Um, oh, because okay. if they're playing two people here, like you guys have three people here, let's say there's two people on site, you trade, her, you, you, uh, he kills her and then you kill him. Now it's two V one. And then the same thing happens. Somebody's like heaven. This, this is all hypothetical. Uh, somebody's right. heaven he kills cypher you kill him and now you have sight you know what i'm saying does that make sense yeah the trade frags are huge so one thing you could definitely be doing here uh i, I noticed you play a little too passive oh yes yeah, yeah yeah and that probably has to do a little bit with confidence which is fine because i understand like you should probably be peeking with your phoenix here or right. or you should be with so with sage be made now on the topic goes if this is a good peak anyways is like i said a completely different thing we're not going to worry about that right now but um you, you see where i'm going though right um just make sure you get trade frags or peak with people um because even if they suck and they're bad it's like it doesn't matter because you get the trade and that's more kills for you 
Oh. And oh yeah, that's exactly what happened too, right? We're right in a tunnel. Wait, what happened? Oh, hang on. Sorry, I, this freaking is so slow. It's very annoying. Yeah, this is exactly what happened. But uh, you didn't really do it properly. But she, he, uh, Sage was killed, and then you killed him. Now this wasn't a trade because he was sitting in the middle of nowhere, and you weren't. You you would have a trade is when you trade or when you get the kill directly after Sage dies, um, right. or your teammate dies. So you, if you were with Sage now, right when she died, you would have. You know, does that make sense? I'm, yeah. I'm talking. I'm saying a lot, but hopefully that makes sense. Um, but you see why this is good now. Because now, even if there's another B player, you guys just go together and, and, and get the kill. Now, he, right. he's he's literally trolling. He's smoking you guys off. Uh, <laughs> now, yeah, he gets he gets the orb, which is good. But, like, that's that's terrible. That's not good. He'd I come guess by... his idea was to block heaven or... I don't know. Yeah, his idea was to block so we can grab the alt orb. But you can just okay. come back and get it later. Or, like, you're holding the angle, so, you know, whatever. But, but that makes sense, though, right? You see what I'm saying? Okay. There's some. Uh, let's skip ahead. You can also like play at two x speed and just like. That's stop. true. I, I think it'll. I think it'll just do the same thing though. But then I gotta like go in here and click it oh, and stuff. Oh yeah. So. Okay, I actually like that you're spamming this. This is good. You're you're. Now you need to move around a little more <laughs> because they can spam you back and it's easier for them too. But oopsies. But if you, uh, like, you shoot a few bullets right now, move to the right, shoot a few more, move to the left, shoot a few more. Does that make sense? Um, but that, that's good. That's not bad. Okay, so what do you do here? What should you do here? Hold the back left corner or hold an angle pretty much. Right, hold an angle for them to peek into you. Uh, I, I feel like you, that's probably not what happens, but... This is good. So, okay, I, I, hope, I hope they swing heaven. Yes, okay, perfect. This is exactly what I wanted. So you see, placement bad? uh, yes. So let's see when you react. I'm gonna pause when you react, when you shoot. So you see how you didn't really react until he was right here. Right. So that being said, this is a hard shot. Now, if you aim your crosshair right here at head, mm -hmm. just don't like I said, the head level, uh, right here, you don't even have to move. You just wait till he walks into your bullet. Because you're you're not gonna react to this shot. Like it's just impossible. Nobody is. It's not it's not just you. A pro player's not hitting that shot. Like they have to hold out a little bit more. Um So that's good. I'm glad that this happened. This is perfect. Does that does that clarify like kind of that answer? Yeah, so like so henceforward when I'm holding like a corner or an angle, I wanna have like a little bit distance from the wall. Yeah, you wanna have some like... distance because you you just not gonna react to this. And like I said, nobody I is. If you have to give a metric, like how much distance should I be holding? That's on you. That's how fast your reaction time is. If it's right here because you're freaking crazy, cool. If it's over here because you're a little slower, that's fine too. It doesn't really matter. Now, at higher levels of play, people are going to be a little more pristine with their angles and they're going to peek them closer. I was going to say, isn't thing... like if I hold too far, they have a better chance at hitting me before. Yeah, so, I but it, that, it, that's still okay to hold out deep because let's say he swings wide. Okay, let, let's just say. For example, the distance between you and him right now is like two inches. Between your crosshair oh, and him right. right now is two inches. If you're aiming here, it's only one inch. So that's an easier shot because you have to you have to adjust less. Does that make sense? Right. And if he peaks the close angle, you still only have to adjust an inch to the right. So if you put it close and he swings wide, you have to adjust more, making it harder to hit and vice versa. If you hold too far and he doesn't swing at all, you have to adjust more so you have to hit. But if you hold right in that middle ground, which that I can't really tell you, you just gotta find. Uh, that's like the sweet spot. Does that does that make sense? Yes. Yes. Okay. Perfect. So yeah, Th this was the right idea. You just held the angle. You just didn't hold it right. Uh, but that wasn't bad, essentially. Or like you know what I'm saying. The idea was correct. You hold an angle. They have to come into you. And if you have if you have better aim, you have better fundamentals, that you hit the shot. Um, that's the biggest thing I think right now is your crosshair placement, and okay. you're also playing a little slow. But that 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 like I said, that part will come later. You'll also you'll play faster once you get more confident. Once you once you actually understand like, once you're like, yeah. yo, I can destroy all these kids. You'll just fly around corners and be confident. <laughs> um, I can I'll, after after we watch a few more rounds or like once we get towards the end of the vod, I'll um, what's it called? I'll uh, I'll, 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 sh I'll show you. I'll just show you a clip. 
Oh, this is good. You're, you're doing the thing. You're holding the angle. But like I said, you're holding it a little too close. Um, but now you know that, so that's okay. What you mean by too close? The crosshair, right? That's yeah, yeah, you're just too close yeah, to the yeah, wall. Yeah, 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 yeah. But it's, it's the right idea, though. That's good. So here, I swing together, but I guess I see fuck. Yeah, so... This was you just you just missed the shot really. This was a no, this was a fine. The peak was fine, I think. Um, I don't okay. think I don't think it was bad, because theoretically he's focused on hitting this guy and then you peek and kill him. But see, you, once again, your crosshair placement's off. If you would have had your crosshair perfect and aiming at his head, uh, not the, obviously that that's tough. That comes with time. But like still, um, if you would have had proper crosshair placement, you you would have just you would have killed him. You would have hit him. But but even that guy, like I cannot even see like his body. Like he's like half covered. Yeah, he was holding a good a good angle to be fair. But um Or if you think your teammate's strolling, just don't peek with them at all. Like if they have an op, uh mm -hmm. you you should pretty much just not peek into them. If your teammate peeks, you you re you aren't really you're you're expected to get the trade, but not really. Because an op you're gonna wanna you're gonna want to push off a sniper with a gun that's that powerful with like abilities and stuff. But like I said, that's a completely other topic. But um, this is, this is, this makes sense though, right? Like you see, so like what's the best play here? Like, uh, I think you just gotta have hit, you either don't peek or you just have your crosshair at a better spot because you could have hit the shot. Like I, I promise you could have um, if your crosshair was like like perfect. Now, th like I said, this is this is pretty. This is a you gotta have really good crosshair placement here, and it'll be a while before you get to that. But um. I think I think you started shooting before you stopped too. Oh shoot! Hold on, that's God. This is a little too far back. I think you're moving before you like you were shooting before you stopped moving. Yeah, you did because your your bullet didn't go by your crosshair. It was a little more to the left. Um, but yeah, I don't think that's bad per se. You just you just missed the shot. And you got to put yourself in a better position to hit the shot. Wow. I.e., yeah, have no. good cross replacement. Um, so that makes sense, though, right? Be good. Yeah. Okay. Cool. We'll watch like a couple more rounds. Oh, this is. Oh, that's not you. Watch a few more rounds, and then we'll go to CT side. Okay. Oh, hold on. Again, why am I here? <laughs> you just said this is a bad spot. Why am I here? At least you knew that. That's good. Because <laughs> that was a bad spot. <laughs> uh, you know why that was a bad spot, right? <laughs> yeah. Okay. Okay. Good. We cannot go in. We need to go somewhere else. B. Uh, all right. Let's skip ahead a little bit. Oh, you died. I feel like he, oh, he yeah. probably just pushed spawn, didn't he? Yeah. No. Okay. So here I'm running back and with my knife and my. Yeah. 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 <laughs> uh, that that's fine. Just know whenever you, this is really basic, whenever you put this many people towards one side of the map, you have to, ex you have to yeah. expect them to be here. Um, and a lot of, actually, crosshair placement follows that. Now, this, this like I said, this is this is a little nitpicky. Uh, it's okay that you, it's, it, you know, it's fine. This is, I'm not too worried about this. This isn't as important. But, you know what I mean, though. Like, you gotta be, you gotta expect them to be there. Oh, so even if I'm running, I should have my crosshair, like... Yes, and, and and the reason why is not only should you have it there just in case he does come around the corner, you can whip out your gun and shoot him. I think one thing you need to be doing is practicing your crosshair placement, like, at all times. Um, When you're running around the map, even if it's, like, even if the round is over, like, it's a... It, their entire team is dead, and you're running around the maps, practice it. Just fly around an angle and, and see where your crosshair lands. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. Um, so... Skip it. Okay, yeah, we can skip it. I don't know why I'm watching this. We'll watch one more T side round. Yep. But... Yeah, whatever. <laughs> He's just old, <laughs> just nothing happened. That's hilarious. Um, okay, there, there's one more cross replacement thing I want to uh, talk about whenever you... Okay, this is perfect, perfect. So, on attacker's side, cross replacement is extremely important because you have to be able to pre-aim, we'll call it. You have to be able to pre-aim the angle. 
so i talked about this a lot in my last coaching video it's on youtube if you want to go look at it and skip through it yeah, you'll sure. you'll see where i talk about it but mm -hmm. whenever you come around an angle you have to expect a player to be there at all times and you don't do that uh you just kind of swing out and your cross is just kind of in the middle of nowhere if he was holding right here like right where my not like this far back but like against this wall or right here you dead you're dead mm -hmm. you know what i'm saying but yeah. if you would have came around this corner with your cross mirror at the right spot, you would have you would have potentially been able to win the fight. Um, and so it becomes specifically important on attacker side, like I said, because you have to be able to do this. You you need to be able to, uh, not necessarily predict where the enemy is, but you you just got to be able to be able to hit the shot. And you're just not gonna hit it if your cross is here. Um, um, and yeah, not that, that's kind of kind of what happened here. But I'll so show you. My Say again, continue. If, if my crosshair was like where she was kind of yeah, she was, was she was of... playing a, an off angle um which is another topic for another day so you just um, you got to just be ready for that but not necessarily that you can't really place your crosshair for you, she just kind of peeked on you that's that's just where you got to have good mechanical aim you just got to be able to flick to her and get the kill anyways because you, you shouldn't you shouldn't be expecting her to be there because if you if you try and predict that, it's just you're trying to predict literally every angle in the game, and it's just then you're just gonna overload right. yourself. Um, so that, that that wasn't really anything you could have done differently. Um, at least to kill her, you could have just you know that part was I'm not too worried about that. Uh, does that make sense? Yeah. And would you consider flicking as like a basic thing in this game? Uh, no? it's not really. I wouldn't call it fundamental. Um, okay. well, I would to a degree, but the thing is, it's like. It's more important to to not so flicking can be inconsistent. Like if you put me in a match, like watch, I'll try and flick to that K right there. Like I can't do it perfectly every time. But if I come around right. this corner with my crosshair on that K, I can do that perfectly every time. Um, so this stuff crosshair placement is more important to learn because flicking you need to know how to do it because it's it's part of aiming. But um, it's much more important to be able to just um, you know, have your crosshair in the right spot so you don't have to flick. Because at the end of the day, if you if you have your crosshair where their head's gonna be, you just you just click mouse one. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> like there's yeah. there's nothing to it. So, but like I said, that was just a spot where you'll just have to just flick down to him and and just kill him. Not much you can do about it. Um. So so what's the best way to learn crosshair placement? Uh, go in maps and just walk around corners. That's all you have to do. Go on a custom game, pretend like an enemy's gonna be somewhere, and just pre-aim it. Uh, I'll show you what I'm talking about after this. We'll we'll get okay. into a game. Okay, um, we'll watch one more round and then we'll jump to CT side. Why am I spot? I just need to skip ahead. I don't know what I'm doing. This is also such a troll. Yeah, yeah. oh, <laughs> well now, that actually, this is okay. <laughs> don't, don't jump again, but the first jump is fine, uh, because you got info. Because they're just not going to be holding that. That's actually good, but don't jump anymore. <laughs> okay, you're ulting. I think you're just aiming a little too high here. Um. <laughs> oh, rip. Uh, yeah, that's okay. This is kind of an example that I was talking about. Like you gotta, you gotta. So what should I have done in this? Situation? Just push through with. The I team? yeah, you get on site. Don't don't sit in this spot. Or either get on site or just play back like this way, back and be main. Like don't don't sit in this little corridor. Play back and hold this like hold the angle. Like expect you know what I'm saying. Wait for a player to walk here or get on site and hold it that way. Uh, either or is fine. No. I would have stayed be main, um, because if you go back site and have to hold this, um, then you have to worry about potentially them throwing stuff from here or coming out of here but if you sit here uh your teammates watching ct in heaven so you don't have to worry about it um now obviously if they die you'll, you'll adjust but that's okay but yeah, that makes sense though right why you why you would hold that once you get bombed that it's all about um shutting down the enemy and you shut down the enemy by having every angle held and they have to come to you um so yeah okay we'll, we'll skip to, to the other side I'm saying T and CT side, by the way. Sorry, I played Counter Strike no, for, that's fine. for years. <laughs> uh, what is going on? Where are we? Are we on? Oh, sick. Okay, perfect. Wow. Oh, I play A too. This is good.
Jesus, this is tough. <laughs> I've, I've never had this happen. Oh god, you died. What happened? Oh, you what? Did you kill somebody with your shock dart? All right, we'll get. To, we'll see. We'll see. So I scout all of them. So like, oh shit, five of their teammates are here. Yeah, but I am open in the. This is this is not a bad angle. I actually like holding this because it's a little unexpected. You can fall off easy, but. This kind of goes back to what we were saying. Like you're just holding the angle too close. Um, if you gotta, you gotta, you know, you gotta play it based on what your reaction time is and how you can, how you can get affected by this. Because I guarantee, yeah, I was about to say they're probably gonna fly around this corner. You're just not gonna shoot them because you just can't react. Um, you know what I'm saying? And that's exactly what happens. Yeah. So you just you can't really hit that. Uh, also, you you know they're coming this way, so don't so don't sit out in the open and just shoot something. Yeah. Hide and then peek out and shoot it. Or what? Okay, so what, what you probably should have done this round is just this angle. Like I said, is it bad? But play back more, um, to where you can see. Okay. More of that. Right there, like the, okay. Well, you know, not not this this situ this is also like blurry. <laughs> not this situation, but this angle because what happens is if you hold head level, if you hold it properly. Uh, okay. I'm just trying to make it where it's not super blurry, but whatever. Let's just bump this back up, because it wasn't helping. Okay, whoa. Okay, this looks a lot better. Oh, this looks way better. Jesus. Bro. <laughs> okay, alright. Yeah, but if you hold this angle... Uh, get closer to this wall so you're not, you know, fully exposed. Kind of like how, remember how that, that one round that Sova was holding with the gun here and you, you said yeah, he was yeah. just barely peeking? Like, mm -hmm. that's a hard shot to hit. Do the same thing. Make it make yourself hard to hit. Uh, and you hold this properly, you, you'll you probably win this duel. But, uh, yeah, you you just kind of peeked out and, yeah. But, I mean, that makes sense. I, I, I'm, you see what you did wrong there. My quiver is never full. Right, you did? Like, you just kind of held it a little weird. Hello? Yep, yep. Okay, just making sure. Sorry, uh, I don't know what's going on. Oh my god, my Discord's dying. Revealing area. Okay, that this arrow's good, actually. Yeah, you can just oh, always see them. That arrow. Also, yeah, uh, that use your mic some. Uh, make sure you, you calm. Get used to doing that. It's very... I know you play League, and it's you just don't call in League, which is annoying. I but... think I do. I, I like call out, hey, everyone. Did you? I think so, yeah. I can't... I, it's, it's not very loud. Oh my loud. god, they're all over there. Oh okay, well he he caught it so. Oh this is this is risky. Um yeah, this this actually is the same thing you did last round right here. Where you just kind of peeked and you were going to shock dart, but if they come around this corner you're dead. Um so instead hide like right here and then peek out, shoot it and then come back. Like do what you just did there except quicker you know what i'm saying yeah put yourself at the uh at a, at a better advantage for longer now you also have an smg so you probably shouldn't play heaven in the first place because there's no close angles <laughs> um mm -hmm. if they fly around this corner you're just not gonna kill them like it's impossible <laughs> you have an smg they'll play like on site or something okay yeah th this is a good angle uh your, your crosshair place is bad but this actual like this hold is not bad now like i said so you where, have where should the crosshair be in this uh here? like right here probably Huh, interesting. I wouldn't even have thought about yeah, yeah, that. Yeah, yeah, uh, th th See, this is also interesting because the thing is, if they let's say they hug this this wall like that my mouse is on. All right. Uh, your crosshair place is going to be different to where if they hug this wall. So mm. this is this is kind of a bad angle because of that. Now, it's not really bad, but you see where I'm saying. Like, you'll have to move your crosshair. You, you know what I'm saying? You'll have to move it accordingly. Yeah. Um. So, yeah. Your team's flanking too. Whenever your team is flanking like this, it's good to push up. Because you're uh here, I'll I'll explain. Because you're they're pushing and now once they come behind, they're about to be like, oh shoot, we're getting flanked, and then you push up and they're like, okay, he just pushed me and I was not expecting that. And you can get free kills. Um or if you don't get the free kill, if you die, they just kill him anyways. Um So yeah, see like that. He he was looking at the heaven guy. If you would have pushed a little earlier, you might have been able to get the kill. And see, perfect. And if you didn't kill him, your heaven guy does. That's a, that's just a, that's a trade frag. Uh, now you don't you want to try to avoid trade frags on TT side, but in a in a, it's a four v two, so it, it it's fine. Um, right. That makes sense, though, right? Oh, your teammate yeah. actually just threw something in your face. Okay, sick. <laughs> 
Uh, yeah. Uh, it's a lot of the same things we're seeing here. Um, I'm assuming you just heard him be. Uh, you don't need to walk this this far. They're, your teammate's already on site. Uh, you, you can run up until now is where you should walk. Oh, Start walking Jesus. now. Yeah, what you do. And this is, like I said, the similar situation where you're peeking with a no. Uh, and if they're there, you're just dead. So what you, if you want to shoot that shock dart, it's fine. But get your gun out, peek the angle first, and then get your, then shoot the dart. Um, so you just, you, ain't, you, won't, you won't be in danger. Oh, you, <laughs> okay, sick. Um, like I said, because it was a good dart. The dart was fine. Yeah, you just got a little scared here. Um, this is also just a hard, see, okay, this is, you just kind of lose this round now, like, there's just, it's gonna be so hard to win. It's not over, but, you know, it's, it's gonna be really tough. One enemy remaining. At least for you to do so, okay, yeah, see, he just, <laughs> he just comes in and wipes <laughs> the floor. But, for you to do something from this position, it, it, it's very tough, it's so, yeah. so you should either instantly run around to heaven, or play off of your teammates, um, and what I mean by that is, once this guy peaks and starts getting kills, now you can run through it. Now you obviously can't run through the slow, it doesn't do anything. But now they're focused on, see, they're both looking heaven focused on uh, Sage, and then he comes around the corner and kills them. And right. let's say he dies, and then you come around this corner, you just kill her. You know what I'm saying? Um, so yeah, a lot of it's just, you just gotta be able to see this stuff out. Now it'll see that they're literally all looking towards, towards uh, heaven. Um, like I said, you can't really walk through the slow, but um, you you see what I'm saying though. You see you see the point. Um, the the idea having the right idea is what's important because once you get the right idea, you can go from there and always always make the right choice. Um, but yeah, okay, that that should that answers that. Oh, that's too. Oh, that's fine. Yeah, you actually won't you won't get seen by that arrow, and that's yeah, good. Like Sometimes, whenever they, whenever I love doing this, when Sova's whiff their arrows, but they think it's good, just holding the angle because they just don't expect me to be there. So you actually could have held that because he probably was like, "Oh shoot, he's gonna see me heaven," and then all of a sudden you just kill him. Okay, good. Oh, hang on, let me go back. Let me th let me think about this. I don't think there's too much to say. Yeah, see how easy this was to hit the shot? Now, if she wasn't looking at you, I know. But, you know what I'm saying? Like, if you expect her to be here and you peek it, that that's such a small adjustment. Um, let me let me go back just to give it more context, I guess. Like, you're expecting her to be there. Boom. Look at that adjustment. It's nothing. It's the easiest shot of your life. If you do this with every angle, you'll never have to actually have good aim. You just, you just, you just press plus <laughs> one. That's what you did there. Now I know you weren't actually fully expecting that. Right, though. you weren't putting your crosshair there because you knew she was going to be there. But this this kind of proves my point of if you have good crosshair placement, this stuff won't happen. Wait, wait, wait. say that again. Like if you have good crosshair placement, you won't have to like this stuff won't happen where like you won't have to worry about making some crazy flick and crazy adjustment and stuff. Like you just right. you just shoot him. <laughs> you just press mouse one. But, yeah, okay, so I expected her, so my crosshair placement was good, but then I didn't expect the Sova to Right, be. and that's okay. I, I I wouldn't have expected him here either, truthfully. Oh, they don't even have Bomb down. Like, I don't, I don't know what he's doing. But the thing is, your team... I, I wasn't looking at this round much. Maybe you should expect him here. Um. So, okay, you know, actually, what you should have done... You probably shouldn't have peaked this in general. Maybe. Because your team's on the flank, so just wait. Because once they come around, then you swing. And then you can get free kills. Um... Now, like I said, she was she was trolling, but um, does that make sense though? Yeah. Okay. Good. 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 Uh, we'll watch like one more round, and then I'll, I'll show you what I'm talking about about the having good cross replacement, like what it does for you. I do the same thing. I draw lines in the wall. <laughs> <laughs> I do that all the time. That actually just took five seconds. I should just play the video. <laughs> yeah, you're not really doing. Okay, you're going to be. That's fine. Yeah, I don't know why Cypher's all of a sudden oh, on A. Over there. Okay, yeah. This is good. Like glad, you, glad you rotated. You, you noticed that there's. Why is there three A? There's only one B, and you rotated off that, so that's good. I'm assuming that's why you rotated at least. Right, yeah. Okay. 
Uh, also, I saw like five enemies in the garage. Oh, okay. Well, there you go. Uh, I really, I don't think there's a whole lot left we need to, to need to watch. Really, uh, I'll show you a clip of mine where I have cross replacement. And you'll see like how it works out. Um, actually, I think this one's good. What's the first clip? Okay, not this one. Already up, already up. Sorry, I'm not, I'm not trying to flex it, myself it, here. It. So you'll see I expect this player to the left corner. Watch where my crosser is. Look at that adjustment. It's it's the smallest of all time. And I, once and again, was expecting this guy to be here. And can my... you go full screen? Oh, shoot. I'm, it, I'm so sorry. Is this full this is, yeah. This... Yeah, this full screen? Yeah. I was expecting this player to be here. That it, I'm on him, literally. I was expecting this player to be here. Crosser's on him. I don't have to move anything. But, you... but did... Did you not expect him to be on the box? Uh, no, I knew he was up here because he had just shot my teammate. Oh, okay. um, Yeah, sorry, I didn't give a lot of context, but... You see the point, though, right? Like, I, I, I am... Ex my aim isn't that crazy. I'm just... I, I'm expect I clear this angle with full faith this guy's gonna be here, and he was. So that, the adjustment I make is, is minimal. It's... There's, I, going from right here to right here is so small. Once again, I know this guy's here. Super small adjustment, if any. Um, like I, I that, there was nothing impressive about that. I just, I just put my crosser where it should be, and I got the kill for free. And um, you did alternate fire, right? You, your cro you didn't even do a headshot. Right, exactly. Um, okay. this is this is a jet alt specific thing. Don't don't worry right. too much about that. But uh, uh, let's just jump ahead. I guarantee I do the same thing. Yeah. Okay. This actually, this next clip's perfect. I hold this angle as jet. This is an off angle. Uh, the, an off angle is where you play somewhere that they don't expect, so you can get a kill for free. And I do this because I can dash, and you'll see where my crosser is. Okay, look, right. it's out. It's not right by the wall. He walks right into it. I just mouse one. Oh my god, it's so much see out. That? Wait, can you play that slow? I didn't even see what oh, happened. Oh, okay, sorry. <laughs> uh, I'll just zoom. I'll slow it down. I just told you like what what you need, to, what you'll see. So I'm your crosshair is like it's out. Okay. It's out. I, this, this is this is a little bad because I need to be aiming like an inch higher. Boom! He swings out, and then this uh, there's two, so it's just kind of kind of weird. But uh, notice if I had held. Now he he peeked it close, um, which is wait. Where is your crosshair now? It's on his head now. Oh. Um. This is this one's not the greatest because there's two players. Let me let me simplify this. Yeah, okay, this is another good one. I'm expecting this player CT. Watch where my crosser goes. I was I was aiming head level the whole time, and when I rounded this corner, look, that's you see my it's you can't see it because I don't know why this video is such low quality. <laughs> but you see like where it is right there? Look at that right. adjust that adjustment is tiny. I, I barely moved my crosser at all and I, it's the freest kill. Um, anyways, I don't really need to show you much. Is that you see where you see where I'm going though, right? Right. I do this with every single kill I get. Every 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 time I play, I'm playing the game. I always just am expecting players to be in places. Um, yeah, this round is this round's whack. This is a good example. The next thing I go, I expect the player window. Look, look what happens. Okay, that was that's kind of a flick, but <laughs> I was gonna say I yeah. didn't even see a cross there. Yeah, just... okay, never mind. <laughs> get on, get on, get on. Uh, okay, I, I'm not gonna show much else because some of this 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 video is I don't know why it's such a low quality. I need to fix that. But anyways, you you see what I'm going with this though? Like you see why this is so important? Because like a lot of these kills I'm getting isn't because I'm just hitting crazy flicks to their face and none of that. It's just because I'm putting my cross there where it should be. And all I gotta do is click mouse one or make a very small adjustment. Um, so that makes sense, right? Um, okay, well, I guess that's that's kind of it. Do you have any other questions? Anything else? Not really. Like, the only thing we talked about was, like, crosshair placements, like...
and the tips to improve is pretty much just go around the map running and try to yeah literally happen. here i uh i can do it real fast i can show you might as well i'll watch it up it'll take a second i think i have it updated though so it shouldn't be too long Okay, it's it's launching, so we're good. Ugh. You see it, right? Yes. Uh, nice app. username, Cap. <laughs> thank you, thank you. Oh, sheets on. Okay. Let's go. Oh, is it gonna make me wait the whole time? No, okay. Okay, uh, here we go. We'll probably gonna have to wait the full like 30 <laughs> seconds. I don't think so. The you can go shirt? ahead and escape, and there's like stop timer or whatever. What? Yeah, perfect. Oh, I can't buy. Okay, it's fine. It doesn't matter. You, you can buy as well. Go escape. Remove, oh remove yeah, that's right. Shop or My alt's ready. I don't want to go stop. Oh uh, sure. Okay. So we'll we'll go T side. It'll it'll just make more sense. All right. So when I'm rounding this angle, boom. See where my crosshair is right there. I was ready. Boom. It, see, it's not perfect, but it's like close, right? Instead of doing this and having to go up there, I'm like right by it, right? I'm expecting these players to be here. Like, looking heaven, looking CT, looking here. Looking... Also, are you like, like, what is that peak called? Is it called like a wide peak? Uh, oh, this? Peak? Yeah, this is like a wide peak. Uh, don't worry about the peaking as much, because I'm just, if these players are here, like, I'm either expecting to get the kill or get traded. Um, but I'm just trying to, I'm, I'm just trying to show you the the, uh, the cross replacement aspect of it, right? Mm -hmm. Um, so yeah, on top of the box, peeking it, peeking this, peeking this close angle, so I'm peeking this next one, uh, looking here, looking here, 30 seconds looking left. here, looking there, looking CT, see, you see, like, all, like, none of this is me, if I flew around every angle like this, like, I would never hit these shots, there's no, there's no world, like, I wouldn't be able to actually kill people, um, but you see how every angle I peek, oopsie, it's wrong button. I'm I'm ready. Seconds left. Like now, this is like my crosshair place is like pretty freak, like pretty solid because I've been playing forever. Um, but does that that makes sense though, right? You see the importance of it. I just wanted to kind of explain like the importance of that. I just leave. That. Uh, okay, yeah. Is there any anything, any other questions? Anything else? Not really. Okay. Uh, I think we're good then. So yeah, go into go into some games. Uh, practice this. Go into a custom game like I just did and practice the same thing. Um, just that's, if you can get that, if you can get cross replacement down at least to a certain level, uh, just go play, play games for a couple weeks, about a week or two, you know, whatever, get a good few of them in and then we, you can come back and then we'll just move on to the next thing. So there's a lot, there's a few more like fundamental things we need to, we'll talk about, but I think it's just important that you worry about this one because this one is huge. Cross replacement is like, is like, like right on the, that's like one of the most important things. Also, they just released ranked. <laughs> yeah, I'm about to I'm about to go grind a bunch. So, yeah, but yeah. Same. So, anything else? Any other questions? Nope. All right, awesome. If you have anything, just just DM me and uh, we'll go from there. But uh, other than that, good luck out there, my man. Uh, yep. Take uh, it yeah. easy. And do I'll... you think uh, we should like meet again? Like yeah, uh, or... if you want to, that's up to you. Um, yeah, yeah, for sure. We'll we'll do it in like I said, about two or three weeks because I you need to have some time to play and like practice these things. Um, agree, agree. Okay. Yeah. So, yeah, uh, like I said, if you have any questions, DM me. I'm going to upload this to YouTube as well. So if there's anything you want to go back and look at, uh, it'll be there. Okay. Um, and, yeah, keep playing keep playing Sova. That, that's a good champ to play. Um, stick with him oh, for now. Oh, yeah, I've been practicing a lot okay. of... Okay, uh, good, good, good. I like him. He's, he's good to play. Uh, Cypher, too. Okay, Cypher's a little tough, but that's those two, at least stick with two. Don't, don't, don't play, like, 100 yeah, champions. Yeah. Play, like, two yeah. of them. Okay. All right, man. Well, I'm going to go. Uh, like I said, good luck, and just message me if you have any questions.